American farmers aren't the only ones looking forward to better U.S.-Cuba relations. Almost half a million Cubans are now working in the private sector. But after decades of relying on the state, it's not easy to run their own businesses. Now, one U.S.-based nonprofit is providing free business training on the island. CCTV's Michael Voss has the story. Nioris Higueras owns one of the most successful private restaurants in Havana, catering mainly to tourists. Since Atelier first opened in 2010, it's more than doubled in size, with tables spreading out onto the roof terrace. She started with four employees. Now there are 15, including her French-trained Cuban chef. It's been a fast learning curve, helped by a free US-funded training course in business skills. I was on the first course at Cuba Emprende, and I learned that I shouldn't be doing the restaurant accounts. It would be too time-consuming. I got someone else to do it. The same with the purchasing. It was wasting too much of my time. In a country with almost no wholesale markets and little to buy in these state-run shops, equipment and supplies are hard to come by. Now that Cubans can travel freely abroad, Mrs. Higueras brings back everything from spices to crockery and cutlery. A lot of the things we need, even salt and pepper, I buy if I go to Peru or the U.S. When I travel, my luggage isn't with me. It's for the restaurant, including pans, knives and pastry bags. There are still plenty of other challenges to running your own business in Cuba. It's not easy for private businesses to publicize themselves here. There are no adverts in state newspapers or on radio and television, and almost no one has the internet. And yet most nights of the week, you need a reservation to get in here. The restaurant relies heavily on word of mouth, although it has had several write-ups in the foreign press, including the New York Times. Now, Nioris Higueras is hoping that better relations with the United States will make it easier for her to expand still further. Michael Voss, CCTV, Havana.